Hey everybody, Dr. Wessel Couch here with another Math and Minecraft episode. Today, I'm going to show you how to visualize the derivative of x to the third using Minecraft. That's right, we're doing calculus in Minecraft. All right, let's get started. For those of you who don't know, the derivative of a function f is defined by f prime of x is equal to the limit as h goes to zero of f of x plus h minus f of x over h. This is a function, and if we evaluate it at x equals a, this gives the slope of the tangent line to the graph of f of x at x equals a. One of the first things you'll show in your calculus class is that the derivative of the function f of x equals x to the third is f prime of x equals 3x squared. You bring the power down in front and you drop one from the power. I'm going to show you how to visualize this in Minecraft using geometry and the limit definition of the derivative. No tangent lines. Here I have a cube with side length x, and here x is equal to 8. So the volume of this cube is x to the third. So here's a way to visualize the function f of x equals x to the third. It's the volume of a cube with length x. By the same logic, f of x plus h is the volume of a cube with side lengths x plus h, where h is a small number. So you can see we still have all the gray blocks as before, but we have this additional layer of colored blocks. So now that we can visualize f of x plus h and f of x, let's take their difference. And what we're left with is just the colored shell. All of the gray blocks are removed. The volume of these blocks is f of x plus h minus f of x. And we want to evaluate the limit as h goes to zero of this volume over h. And it turns out that the interior surface area of this shell is what you get when you divide by h and take the limit as h goes to zero. Since this surface is made up of three x by x squares, its surface area is three x squared. So the derivative of x to the third is three x squared. There you have it, folks. Calculus in Minecraft. They said it couldn't be done. Let me know what you thought of this visualization. I think it's nice to see a geometric approach instead of the usual tangent line. And let me know in the comments if you have any ideas for a future episode. I always love hearing from you. Share this video with your friends. It will really help me out. And make sure to smash the like button before you get out of here. All right. Bye-bye.